Once upon a time, night fell on two travelers crossing the mountains. Do you believe in evil spirits and haunted things? One of the travelers asked Kid's friend. No, of course not. The other replied, I sell old things for a living, which many claim are cursed. The doubting traveler stumbled over a branch and hurt himself badly. The doubting traveler's friend knew he was hurt too badly to continue, but even though their map showed nothing but trees and wild land around them, they saw lights of a little house glowing not so far away. Travelers sought refuge in the house and were welcomed inside by the kind girl who lived there. The girl poured them some tea and bandaged the doubting traveler's injured leg. What are you doing out here all alone? The travelers asked her. The girl simply smiled and said, I live here. But for a moment, a look of sadness crossed her face, as if she wished she might be somewhere else. She warned the travelers that the land outside was dangerous. They should stay inside until morning. The girl excused herself going to fetch some more firewood. Once the girl was gone, the doubting traveler began to search the house. Though thankful for the girl's kindness, he could not trust her. The girl had lived in the house a long time, and even though she was kind, a deep, dark hunger lingered in her chest. The girl's hunger forced her to attack the travelers. She ran outside to face the hunger. She had warned the travelers, waited for them in the dark. When the doubting traveler saw what waited outside, he tried to escape. Never enough. I'm still so hungry. I'm hungry! But the girl was too fast. She attacked him, as, just as hungry for his soul as for his friends. about the girl's hunger, but when he fought back to save himself, he happened to save her too. Once upon a time, day broke on two travelers and a girl who no longer lived in the hungry dark. How's the sunshine feel? Good to be back. <laughs>